Hello everyone, welcome back to Space Engineers Hardcore Survival. Now it has been a very, very long time since I've last played this. Um, I last looked at the save and it was the 24th of something, 24th of March I think it was and well at the minute it is the 2nd of June and a lot has changed in Space Engineers since I have last played it. Uh, being the signal update, now to be honest I've bought this pack whenever I came out but I never got a chance to actually explore it so I have no idea like what's what's in it and that there so I want to look to see if it's here is there a signal update one da, 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 looking through it here the emotes automations yeah that's pretty much the same isn't it decorative blocks Um, they're all oh signal blocks here we are so we've got all this here. I'm sure you've all seen it all before, so I'm only looking over this for my own benefit. Uh, oh, we've got pillars now. That's cool. Trust pillars. A trust light. Lights are used to eliminate interiors or can be used. So what way does this work? I'm just going to grab that down. I want to see what that looks like. Oh. Actually kind of cool. I like that way to display on it now. That's cool. But yeah, um, a lot has happened on this here since the last episode. I know I was wilding up a few things. I don't know if I showed this um, or not. I can't really remember what's happening here. Um, oh yes, I did. I built this here. So this allows us to gather resources and put it in through the conveyor without actually having to like go all the way down and back up. Because I noticed that a lot of time I spent coming up and down this verge here and uh, I'm just looking to see if there's any reavers because the last time if I remember rightly there was a reaver that came into the area and our repeater stations are still there the unfortunate thing is uh, driving remote control ships to go to asteroids is not going to be um, as successful as we had hoped being that um, you need to have the actual like character within like the rendering zone up there in order for the asteroids to appear. So even if we did send a drone up there, um, the asteroids won't spawn in there naturally. I think the way to overcome that is to put the spectator cam up there and let them render in that way. Because I think the spectator camera counts as... Um, an entity that will allow stuff to load up. Now the game is sort of juddering a wee bit. It has been a while since I played it, so it has been there was there was a massive update for it, so I think it's just settling. And also I haven't updated my graphics drivers. Uh, oh there we go. Now we've got the joy come where is that coming from? Oh there's a slayer coming. I think we have ammunition. I don't know. I meant to I think going and getting magnesium was on the list of things to do. I did have a list somewhere on my desk but I did a clean up and I think I might have thrown it out by accident um, because I do vaguely remember writing stuff on it to do but the thing was it was on an A4 sheet where everything else is on it uh, let me see close these doors I think we've got remote blocks as well now so we can like I think that's actually. Oh. I kind of want to see if that's actually targeting that. Oh, yes, yes, yes! It took it out, it took it out. Oh, do I have to go up there and salvage that way? I'll go down here and see if I can find the mule. I want to go up there and salvage that. So the guns are uh, defending the base, that's very good. A good start to the episode. But yeah, um, very good so far. Oh, that's the mole. Not the mule. Oh, the, the mule's on its um, legs. This was for mining. Yes, that's for mining asteroids. But this um, mole never got actually fixed. And that never got fixed up either. Because uh, we didn't actually need it. Uh, what else is in here as well as that? Mothership. What's it doing here? 
Oh, that was moved out of the way for the build this year. Never mind. Right. Um, let's run up there. And uh, just we'll dismantle all the stuff and put it into the conveyor tube that is next to it. I didn't get all this here welded up. I know that the last time I was on this here, I did say I would try and get all this welded up. Um, I did get a good bit of it done, and I got all this here done. I think I did show that, though. Um, so... Yeah, I'm going to make my way up here. I'm just going to pause uh, Well, pause the uh, recording here, because I'm not going to show me going all the way up here. Okay, I've made it up. Uh, let's have a look and see what's going on up here. Now, I need to be careful. Oh, some of it took damage. Uh, but most of it's still intact, so the welder just came off. Right, let's go and see what we can salvage from this. What's that? Ice? Oh, temporary container. That's cool. Dump that in. There we go. So we've got some ice. That's good. Nothing else salvageable. There's battery there. I think most of it destroyed on impact. I don't see anything else about it. Let's grind it up anyway. Some components... What's that? That's alright. Should we know that anyway because we have it set up that we will lose some pieces. I kind of want to disable that, um, if there is something doing it. Oh, we don't have a charge up. Um, was there a cockpit I put outside? I thought I put a cockpit out to charge up. But I might try to see if I can put a fire chamber out here. Brand is all up here anyway. I'll take the... Oh. Hammer off, so that'll be... Consuming. I meant to charge up when I was done. No there we go. Let's see what else there was. No. I don't actually think I'm going to bother with any of that. All the stuff. Sometimes stuff falls down here. Ah, I can see it. Fuel There's some stuff down here. Down there. I'll get that later. And that's about. Sometimes stuff rolls down the hill. Ah, here's the most of it here. Uh, what's this? Oh, ammo box. And more ice. Don't mind if I do. Right, what else is on this? Uh, a few bits and pieces. There's cockpit, but nothing salvageable, as in um, worth fixing it up and using it. But yeah, um, we'll, we'll go down here anyway with this stuff, and well, I am out of energy, so there's nothing else we can do in terms of like... Do I not put a uh, cockpit or something up here? I thought I did. Maybe I didn't. It was just for charging up in case. Anyway, I, as I said, I'm going to just skip until we get back down here and get charged up. In fact, I'll just resume it whenever I come back up here after charging. Right, I'm back. So I just decided to come out here first and have a look to see if there's anything down here. And I don't think there is. No, I'm just going to leave that. I'll take that though. And then we'll make our way up and collect the scrap as we go along. So it's tumbled its way down here. I wonder if I get up here alright. Oh, well. Yep. Some bits of scrap here. Uh, where bits was that we fought on bit? Have they done something with the texture? So, that looks like iron there. I wonder if that is. I wonder if they've done something with the textures. 
I haven't read the change notes, so I don't know what all has changed, if anything. Oh. That's a large hole there. What's smoking over here? I'll take that. Nothing right there. Trash removal will uh, deal with that. And I'll take that. Uh, the hinges some parts that there be handy. And let's see. This here as well. We're actually getting on fairly well with the spirit parts, according to this here. Maybe that's an allegiance that we might go with. And then stab them in the back. <laughs> oh, this will be juicy. Let's get rid of this. Um, because what we could do is we could effectively pirate the pirates. Um, and what I mean by that is if we get, like, we don't we don't like the pirates first of all, but we're just having an allegiance with them just to take their stuff. Oh, what's down here? What's that down there? Oh, there's something else that's falling down there. Uh, nothing worth here. Ah, oh, days. What we could do is we could um, take their ships for parts. You know, like actually like hijack them and still remain as allegiance. Oh, take the batteries. Oh. Don't think there's an anything else worth salvaging off these, no. What's on that ladder? No, I'm not bothered with that. Uh, oh, nearly missed this. I'll do it. I'm going to leave the rest. That's not worth coming back for. Uh, we do need to fix this here, though. So I'll get that set up here now. Right. What needs to be fixed up? Well, it's... It's welder, isn't it? Comes out. Oh no, there's a welder that comes out on that. Uh, let's go get some more parts. I need interior plate. And a few other wee bits and pieces. So those are auto cannon turns, that's good. So they are fully loaded, that's okay. I take some of these here and some of these. And then what I need to do is build a welder. Oh. Welder. And we have conveyor tubes, that's okay. So that's going there. And seven. That's going here. And then a the welder here. Nine. And same on the other side. Uh, seven here. And nine here. Yep. And while this here up. One, two, three, four, and five. And that's it. Let's get all that stuff. Um do, 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 do. put all that first and then get all the, the rest of it. And there. There we go. That's Erin. They just wild it all up. Uh, what type of wild is this? Oh, we haven't found platinum yet. That's why we can't make any better. So, some of you might be wondering, what, I, what have I been doing in the meantime uh, since I last did this? So, a lot happened. Um, I recently got a promotion at work, and it has involved taking more responsibilities. So. I'm just trying to get into the role to get used to it. And I feel like I have at the minute getting used to it. So now I know there's less pressure on that and even times to do different things. And I've got a bit more free time. Let's grind this here up. 
but I also have been getting back into some older games just to sort of like um, wind down as well. Uh, one of them being, if anybody's ever played it, is 5M for Grand Theft Auto V. It's like a mod, a modded platforms, multiplayer modded, sorry, it's a modded multiplayer platform. So it allows you to pretty much like set up a server for whatever you like. Uh, it could be like role base, it could be tycoon based. And the one that I happen to play is uh, Transport Tycoon, which is my favourite server on it. There's a Cops and Robbers server as well, where it's like, um, say you've like a server of 50 people, uh, 49 of them are cops and one of them is robbers, and it's the, the goal is to let they stay out for as long as possible as a robber before getting caught. And obviously the longer you're out, the more points you get. And then there's like all these like different things where you can like level up and stuff. Uh, so it gives you purpose. Uh, let's see what there. Uh, turn them on. And let's take it forward. Uh, what's the maximum distance? One. Oh. Up in there. Uh, let's take it another bit forward. Um, apparently they've done something with the welders as well. They've done something with the... Oh. They've done something with the reach. That'll do. Yeah, that's fully wilded up. That's okay. So I'm gonna leave them switched on. They're gonna wild up as the as they go along, and while well, there's nothing to wild the wilder. But a suggestion that was given to me ages ago. Um, I can't remember what your name is, but if. Uh, well, you probably know who you are. Had suggested if we put like a say a decoy block over here and a welder pointing at it. So like say a tube's coming over with a welder on the end of it, and then on the end of the welder is a decoy block. Then what we could do is, uh, it'll, well, what it'll do is it'll divert or should divert most of the um, fire at the decoy block, and as it gets hit, the welders are welding it up. So I think that would be worth putting in. Now, the thing is, uh, most of the rivers seem to come from this direction, so it would make sense to put it sort of over here. We do have space here on this, so oh, I think we could actually take this here over and away and use that. I think that's what I'm going to focus this here episode on, is, um... Oh! Oh, that wasn't that. Well, let's get rid of it. And then we'll build, um... Some parts out. Um, something else is there. There we go. Um, so I think something like that would be good. And well, I think we pretty much have the name of our episode, which will be something along the lines of um, decoys or setting up decoys. Let's get that and then build it out. So um, we can't build it in here because it still thinks there's something else here, or maybe something up here. Aha, there it is. There we go. And we get this and build this here along. We will put the welder on the end of it. I'm going to build this over as far as I can get it. Oh, come on, please. Oh, it is excellent. So it shows it here. And I could put the welder here. I could put the welder straight up and then put the decoy on top of that, but then risk the stray fire hitting it. So I think it would make sense to put it... Oh wait, this has to be somewhere where there's no ground around it, isn't there? Yeah, it has to be above ground. Right, so... Um, I think what would have to happen here is put a, um, some sort of a tube pointing up. Uh, but we'll get the one, this one here. Uh, put that on the end, and then put the, the welder on top. Oh, I won't go there because of this one big piece here. And, can I put it actually like that? No. Let's get a wee bit of red, red here because I want 
I do want that to be sort of facing it out a bit. Uh, let's get off uh, that there mode. Aha! Now, I need to turn this around. That is, that's right, that's okay. So that's going there, and then decoy block is going in front of that. And we could build actually a hood. Let's build a, a bit of a hood over. And we'll do that in armoured blocks. So we'll put like a... Actually, that actually should be been armoured the whole way along there. Um, that should have been armoured on top of that. I don't know why I didn't do that. Anyway, let's put this here on it. We'll put a shell over. And then this can be half blocks going the whole way along. I'll do it. So that's just going to cover that. And then if I can get out on top of that, no, I can't. There we go. And then this can be a half block going up, followed by a half block going across, another going here, and decoy block underneath that. We probably could do, put two there, couldn't we? Will that weld? All of them. Yeah, let's put three. And since that's there, we will put ba, 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 a slope block tapering off those coming into this. Like that. And then I'll take the top one off, and at least then it'll be fired upon. There, and there we go, like that. And then take this here off. See so if you can get on top of this. Um, I might actually just keep. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna keep the top ones on that. Let's put on the lights here so we can see what we're um, welding up. I'm gonna keep the top one on that. It's gonna cover the welder, keep it um, covered, and then yeah, the same on here. We'll put the actually put another one coming down. Yeah, that'll do. Now let's weld these here up, and uh, I won't be able to get the welder, will I? Nope. Let's do this. And that. And there we go. Get all them pieces. Alright. Weld up as much as this we can. Put Aaron into this. Just get rid of all the stuff. So we get more in the inventory. What are we looking radio components for? Oh, that's the decoys. it up as we go along. I think we have some radio components, don't we? Uh, no. So we'll go and make them. those up uh, as long as they're done first and that's okay I might change them to a different texture just to get the sake of it done and let's put that there together I 
And then the rest of the pipes. There we go. Don't need them all, but I'd rather have them as much as possible. It's so slow. Uh, I wonder if we get the one around here. Oh, nearly. Uh, take these here away. Right, like that. And then I'll weld the uh, armor blocks on top. Whoop. Oh, I thought we get that. Probably could weld it from the other side, but. There you go. That's all green, is it? Yep. So that is effectively welded up. I think it will reach these other two. If not, not a big deal. Uh, but I will go and get a load of plate now and weld that there up. And then I might change the colour. I'll see. Uh, let's see. Hide empty. I wish that was kind of default. No. Where just hide the empty base. I feel like I hide it more than I show it. I'm um, gonna start from here. Energy low. Get more of that. Steel. And their energy is low, so we could actually do that. Um, We could do it. I'm um, having a charging bay up here. In fact, I'm gonna do that. I think we should build a cryo chamber out here somewhere, or a small cockpit for charging. But I feel like that will be the first thing to get targeted. Well, then it makes sense to build it on this, wouldn't it? I think it would. Uh, suppose we can make it in a second. Steel. Do all this here first. And then number six. And right here. That's that. all valid. Oh. Some stuff got valid there. Right, I think that'll do. Um... I don't have enough there to weld up, do I? Uh, turn off the... I need to get a cockpit going. Uh, just a very basic cockpit, something. To go on the front. I think that'll do. Oh wait, no. What's on our other build menu? Why is that not making that? How have we run out of space already? Uh, I suppose I can go there. Right, we'll weld up here. Oh. Zone up. And get some more parts. 
There we go. Right, I'm gonna charge up here for a second and then we'll go and repaint. Right, uh, so the projection is still going for that. That's okay. Uh, this is covered enough. I'm happy enough with those as long as those are exposed. And we've got a welder that's gonna do the job. And that's all covered up there, so that'll take fire. We can weld it. If anything happens. Uh, right, let's change the colour a bit. I think we should go for... Well, I think it would make sense to go for this here for the top of the wall. Oh, I actually hit the whole shift, didn't I? I will, we'll change everything. And then I'll change the pipes back. Oh, <laughs> it's weird the way that throws you off like that. So that's that. That. Let's see. Uh, I can't get that one. I wish there was like a filter where it was like color only block, no like armor blocks or color only conveyor blocks. That'd be kind of cool if you could do that. Right, I think that's good enough. And uh, the decoy blocks, I'm happy enough with them being left at that color. Gonna get rid of those, I'm, I'm not looking at them. Right, so that's that done. Uh, put in there. There we go, just turn everything back on again so I can see. Right, what have we got? We've got Asa assert bases around here uh, we've got a cockpit for charging so that's all right the only reason well the only reason it will come up here is literally just for charging um we shouldn't have any reason to come up here all the time unless we're watching the uh the fireworks going off and all this here going but i'm, I'm hoping now that those there will take most of the hit and I've got these welders on backup as well, just to keep all this here welded in case they do get hit as well. Um, let me see, I'm just gonna color that there. Yeah, so it should should do the job. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna end up so there. Um, we have pretty much got all that done. In the next one, I think we should go and look for more platinum. I feel like that. Is the way to go once we get platinum we'll be able to make ion thrusters so then we can heavily rely on just electricity alone we've got turbines down there uh, which I think we might need to finish off as an um, weld up the uh, support and all let me just check yeah I can see it the support down there's still bare so that is worth finishing off uh, but in terms of electricity, we are good, and I would like to, f I would like to build a solar array. That would be something I'd like. But putting it up here is a bit um, risky, and I don't want to put it away over there. Like I don't want to have to build like, uh, I don't want to have to build like conveyors and connect it up onto a mat like that and have it over there for two reasons. One, that's going to take a serious amount of time to do, and second of all, if reavers come from that direction, they're going to be the first line um, of hit. Now we could build something similar to what we have there with decoys and that there and the guns, but that's an awful lot of work, and I don't really feel like doing that. It would make sense to put the actual like solar panel array right up here, and have it on a hinge so that it can fold down and we can weld it up in case something no comes off and it needs to be repaired. Um, but I'd rather build that first in like um in like complex creations and then import it over to this here so that it could be welded up quickly rather than trying to build it here that's what we did trying to do on the the last base we were at um, although it didn't I don't think it did get the chance to go up in the sky I think it just sort of laid flat the whole time and it only got the daytime sun as in like it only got it like when it was at um, noon Right, um, yeah, I'm going to end the episode there. Uh, thanks very much for watching. 
If you have any comments or any suggestions at all for this here series, do drop it down below or visit Discord channel that is linked in the description. Follow the Discord channel for the schedule as well as the information board. There you'll be able to see what games we're playing as well as when those games are coming out onto YouTube. And of course, if you're enjoying the content, do consider subscribing and drop us a like if you enjoy it to see. As you know, I have show what people interest in the most and I will try and focus those areas a bit more in the future. But other than that, thanks again for watching and I will certainly see you in the next one. I would like to give a massive shout out to the channel donators. You help make these videos possible.